Good morning student in our previous period we completed up to exercise 3 which is given in our textbook page 31 okay so now moving on further with the next exercise which is given speaking and writing in our textbook page 32 okay so if you people having a textbook with you then open and pay attention in that in speaking and writing First question is given that suppose you are one of the volunteer who went to the Andaman and Nicobar Island for relief work after the tsunami. So after the tsunami attack or hit tsunami then after as a volunteer you went to the Andaman and Nicobar Island for the relief work you work in the relief campus distributing food, water and medicine among the victims and those are the persons who are affected by the tsunami as a volunteer you help them you listen to the various stories of bravery of ordinary people even as they fight against odds to bring about some semblance semblance that means that in actually the situation is different okay that is the semblance of normalcy now normalcy means what now the situation is totally different uh, different but we are trying to uh, politely behaved or politely deal with that particular situation as the tsunami hit and because of that natural disaster so many people are affected by that particular situation so the situation is totally differ as they are facing so many problems yes but we have to deal or we have to cop up with that situation in that way that they can feel some relief some relax in that particular situation okay so you admire their greed and determination write a diary entry so now we have to write down diary entry for this situation as they facing that situation with so much brave nature or with the bravery so we have to write down about that that in this natural disaster so many ordinary people ordinary people means the person like us yes we are mean simple the peoples which not facing such a situation in their life as they facing suddenly the this much hard time now we have to write down about uh, the diary about this particular situation as a volunteer we went there we helped them and we heard so many stories of so many different different persons and now we have to write down diary uh, about this particular situation so first write down this question so before i start writing you people also be ready with your notebook and start writing with me so as we are doing unit 2 and just now we are doing textbook portion so in page 32 speaking and writing speaking and writing under this heading First question is given. Suppose you are one, one of the volunteer volunteers tears who went to the went to the andaman and nicobar Nicobar Islands Islands for relief work for 
relief work after the tsunami after the tsunami you work in the you work in the relief campus distributing in this relief campus actually what we have to do we have to distributing food as a volunteer as we are a part of that as we are a part of tsunami so in relief campus what we have to do we have to uh, providing this we have to distributing food yes then water and medicine among those who are the victim who are facing that situation okay so as we are the volunteer so we have to do all these things water and and medicine medicine among the victims victims this affected people those people who are affected by tsunami okay you listen you listen to the various stories of and as you are there so you listen there so many different different stories of the diff, of the different different people who how they facing that situation with the bravery okay and yes in our unit this too in tsunami that story also we read it about uh, different different people how they tackle the situation with such a bravery so in that way so you listen to the various stories of bravery of ordinary people ordinary people means we are the simple people ordinary people and we have not face such type of situation as earlier in or the previously in our life so suddenly when we face such situation then how we deal with it against odds to bring to bring about some semblance now that means means the situation is actually it's looking different yes but of normal see now the whatever the situation we are trying that the situation comes to be a uh, in a look like a simple way or a simple manner actually it is a differ but we have to try that it's look like in a simple way simple manner means it's look like too easy not that much hard or tough in their lives as they are totally disturbed as they facing such a hard time so as they are 
means have so much fear yes of particular situations so, so much means disturbance in their lives now we have to try to deal that we have to try to make that situation in a normal way you admire you admire their greed greed means as they strongly behave that uh, deal that situation strongly or the bravery so we have to admire their greed and determination as they deal with the particular situation so we have to admire that greed and determination so now what we have to do we have to write down a diary and three okay so now start writing with the diary entry now first of all that what is the diary entry if you know or not know then little bit i tell you about the diary entry means we having such a habit that we maintain a diary yes and whatever the thing or whatever means we uh, usually what happened with us in a whole one day okay in that whole one day means some interesting thing are there which gives us so happiness or whatever we experience or whatever the sad thing whatever is going on in a one day we are at night or when we getting a time in a whole day we write a diary yes generally we are writing in a diary uh, at night only because we have to write down about whole day situation so people having such a habit that they maintain diary yes and in that they write down the whole day's activity that today this thing is happened this thing in this way i experienced this thing or whatever the situation they facing whole day some having habit to maintain regular day diary and some people having habit that they maintain the diary and in that they write down about their most happiness situation or the sadness situation or what they experience new in their life they write down or events whatever they uh, uh, means uh, come to know or whatever the events they follow means they everything they maintain in that diary okay so that is the diary in diary now for the diary writing there is no particular any rule in our grammar yes one thing we have to keep in our mind when we are writing diary what we have to do means for example if today i am writing diary then must i have to must write down the date today's date i have to mention in the diary that this day and date and means the year fully date if we write then it include the that day also that month also and the year also so in this way we have to write down diary otherwise there is no any rule given in our grammar that we have to write down because in a normal way uh, we are writing in that so not any format is there but must be a date should be there okay so now we start with this diary as we have to assume this situation suppose is given so we are assuming that we are the volunteer we went there and we help them the victims of the tsunami and then after we write down the whole situation in our diary so now in our book that at the end one line is given that you may start in this way means one line is given that you may start in a this way see date is given now so we have to start diary with the date some date is given that 31 december 2004 the killer tsunami struck this island 5 days ago 
but the victims are being brought it even now each one has a story to tell so in this way we can start okay so a little bit hint is given that in this way you can start your diary so now start writing whatever the hint is given we are going to use that hint that 31 december 2004 the killer tsunami as tsunami hit everything in such a way that we use a killer word for the tsunami because due to tsunami there are so many thing we lost so the killer tsunami struck this island islands 5 days 5 days ago but the but the victims victims are being are being brought brought in e1 now now each one has each one has a story to each one has a story to tell and this is the thing that if something happen uh, means a hard time or something wrong is happened with us so after that thing what happened if for example just an example that some incident is happened with me then after the means 2 3 days passed away after that incident but obviously i am going to share the whole thing with the other uh, person yes or no that this thing is happened and how i faced that situation so in the same way now each everyone having a story to tell a 13 a 13 year old boy a 13 year old boy told me told me how he how he saved seven lives how he saved seven lives an old an old lady and her and her granddaughters grand daughter daughter were saved by a boatman so now some having the story that that particular person saved another lives okay and some who are telling their story as they are saved by the other person that 
the a, an old lady and her granddaughter was saved by a boatman that is saved by a boatman and a 13 year old boy told me how he saved seven lives as they are uh, they saving seven lives okay so means everyone having a particular stories people tell stories people tell stories how they how they lost their loved ones their loved ones when the huge waves huge waves came crashing down some lost their parents some lost their parents some siblings and some other other their la their wives and husbands so means those who are facing this situation tsunami means they having a have they lost some what okay everyone lost some what as those who are facing this tsunami some lost their parents some lost their siblings some other their wives their husbands okay then after many people many people have lost all their families and some are there who lost all their family member member members rescue rescue means rescue team is those person who are helping us to save from the danger that is the rescue okay so rescue operations operations are are still under way and every day every day survivors survivors are being found stranded 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 that means left a ground on a shore so means every day find a survivors are being found 
trend date. Then after stranded on different islands. The survivors, the survivors are struggling, are struggling hard to get back to get back to life I am deeply touched by their I am deeply touched by their greed and determination and determination to live so as in our question it is given that we are writing a diary after the five days yes or no means this the situation is happened and then after we are writing this diary so as after means the day passed but then also still survivors are found by the that rescue operation that rescue teams are there who found the survivors okay and survivors are found by the different islands also and just now also the situation is not means that much normal means they are still facing uh, they having that fear in their mind that what they faced at that time okay so in this way we have to write down the diary that what we experienced there as a volunteer when we went there when we worked as a volunteer we helped them and then after we come to know so, so many things a different person having a different story to tell us they having a means uh, they are still having that fear in his mind they lost so many thing in this particular disaster and then after we have to write down a diary about that particular situation so for the diary there is a no particular rule but you have to keep in our mind that we have to mention date properly okay so and yes writing diary is it's a good habit if you people want to maintain a diary but in your personal diary then you can it is it's a good habit that you can come to know learn the writing skill and your english language skill also okay so student in this period up to this much now further will be continue in our next period so just read it out this diary what we completed just now thank you goodbye